and it is a choice that people are making now as someone who's shown endurance of a different scale by summiting a Mount Everest uh, twice. Yeah, so my diet is actually, to, to be honest, not that much different, at least when it comes to the nutrients. Uh, it's not that much different from, you know, before I went vegan, um, when, when from what I was eating as a vegetarian, or even from, you know, before that, when, when I was still eating meat. Um, so the nutrients didn't really change. I'm, I'm still giving my body all the nutrients that I, wa that I was giving my body before. Now, where do I get those nutrients? Like, for instance, uh, a lot of people ask, well, wh where do you get all the protein that you need, right? As a strength athlete, we're consuming usually way too much protein uh, because it's the building blocks for muscle and we're trying to, you know, have an abundance of, of that for the body uh, so that the body can build muscle. Um, now, my main protein sources are mostly legumes and grains, mostly legumes, uh, and that's just one word, but really it's a category of, you know, a, a ton of different things like beans, chickpeas, peas, lentils, um, soybeans, um, and, and other soy products like soy milk and uh, stuff like that. Uh, from time to time, I also eat uh, meat replacements, for instance. When, when you have something like, uh, you know, burg a plant-based burger patty, of course, it's fun to eat it, but it also gives you a lot of protein. So it's really the, the rationale is the same that you would use to eat, um, you know, a, a meat burger. But in this case, the, the great uh, benefit that you get is that, um, you know, you're having the same fun, um, but nobody has to be killed for it, right? So, so and, and that's, I think, really important too. So I had all these physical benefits, like my blood pressure went down, my recovery times were getting better. There was, you know, a whole slew of uh, stuff that was helping me perform as an athlete uh, and giving me an edge there. But at the same time, one of the biggest differences was, was also that eating became way more fun. Because for the first time in my life, um, I felt way more in line when I would sit down and eat. I felt way more in line with my own values. And I knew that I was trying to reduce the amount of exploitation and, and suffering produced by my own consumption. Yeah, I have to really say it is definitely the best decision I ever made in my whole life. It's impacted my life on so many levels and it really changed my life so positively that... Um, you know, I, I think a lot of people really underestimate um, the, the 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 benefits. I mean, I think we a lot of people already know that there are benefits. You know, for 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 the environment, uh, for climate change, and for um, you know for health reasons, and and uh, also of course for the animals. But I think a lot of people really underestimate um, the benefits for yourself in going vegan. It's really it's really the best thing that you can do for everyone, for, you know, for yourself, for the planet, for the animals, everybody wins. All right. So that's a message there from Patrick Babumian, a strongman and powerlifter and former bodybuilder.